Hey everybody, Dylan Borland here over at the Borland Group, working late, working hard, got a lot of great things going on. Hey, I wanted to chat with you guys briefly. I get asked a question all the time as we work with coaching clients, and I understand a lot of people out there are, are very hesitant um, to start coaching, and I got to tell you my own personal experience, right? When I started coaching in 2006, I was also, quite frankly, scared shitless, right? Um, the coaching at the time for me was a thousand dollars a month. It was a 12 month commitment and I think I had just made a whopping twenty thousand dollars or something for the year, right? I mean, I didn't have the money to pay for it. Um, and I was just you know reminded of the fact that and somebody told me very bluntly, Dylan, you know, if I could make you a hundred thousand dollars for the year and it cost you twelve thousand, then what are you worried about, right? And for some reason, you know, for me, uh, that clicked, but it didn't make it any less scary, right? And I did it. And thank God I did it because that year, um, everything that was supposed to happen came true. And I wouldn't be where I was at today, uh, quite frankly. And I wouldn't continue to excel where we're at in our business today if it wasn't a direct result of coaching guys. I'm still in coaching myself. I have a sales coach. I have an investing coach. I have a life coach. I had a golf coach. I'm looking for a new golf coach, um, right? So coaching is a direct responsibility for where we're at in our business today. And I use the same systems that I'm coached on uh, for our real estate investing clients um, as well too. But guys, I know it's not scary. Um, and when the student is ready, the teacher will appear is the old saying, right? Um, so sometimes you guys just got to take a leap of faith and do what's uh, in your gut and do what's in your heart. The best thing I can tell you about coaching is don't try to make it your own, guys. Coaching is something that if you exercise blind faith and you do everything your coach is telling you to do, you're going to succeed. Uh, the people who I've seen fail in coaching are the ones who try to make it their own, the ones who try to put a spin on it. Guys, don't try any of that until you get to the level of the coach, until you get to doing more than what your coach has ever done, right? Simply follow the path. The fastest way to success is to follow the people that have already been there. And then if you want to make it your own, make it your own. But um, I get it, guys. Um, for those of you out there who may... Uh, beyond the fence, you got to take the leap of faith, but only when you're ready, right? When you are ready, the teacher will appear. Hopefully you guys are having a great week and you're out there, you're achieving your goals and uh, we'll talk to you soon. Don't forget this Thursday, every Thursday at 6 p.m., we are doing a live stream where we answer your questions about real estate investing live. So make sure you guys tune in on Facebook. We'll see you then.